Hail and Meshes Adventures. Welcome to the Starfield, it's me the Spot King, and today I will show you how to max out all the skills, almost all the skills, very fast. I got some awesome secret unique loops, how you can max out most of the skills just in no time. Bro level 300, with a lot of skills, basically every skill unlocked, but still we need to go and somehow level up the skills, because if you know in Starfield you can't just go and spend your skill points to level up skills. You need to do some mini quests. Some of skills is pretty self-explanatory. So something like ballistics and basically every skill in this combat category is self-explanatory. You just need to go and kill 50 enemies with ballistic weapons. So equip weapon, go and kill enemies. Simple. So first of all, we are going on the planet and we're getting onto Jameson, like basic planet that you will see from the start of the game and we want to land not in the city we want to land into any area that is written as forest for example as forest it's nice let's go into the forest and i will explain you how to level up super fast my level up my awesome level up loops so first loop first loop will be like that we're going to level up fitness weightlifting and wellness at the same time, at the same time, we will be leveling up gymnastics first level. So what we need to do, we need to use all our available oxygen 20 times. We need to sprint 1000 meters while we are at 75% capacity and we need to heal 500 damage. We need to take 100 fall damage for gymnastics. So how you do it, you basically equip a lot of items, get all items on yourself, make sure your mass is almost at maximum. And again, it's self-explanatory, you will just use oxygen when running. And as you can see, oxygen running up pretty like slowly. And when you level up this stuff, it will be a lot more slower. So what you want to do, instead of going at 75% capacity or a little bit more, you want to overload yourself. So just go into cargo cold, equip some items and make sure you're encumbered. So you will see this pop up. And you can find this ship easily if you watch my video on how to get this armor, this best weapon in the game and this best ship. So what you want to do, you basically want to sprint, you will lose your oxygen pretty fast and basically sprint until you will be an out of oxygen. So now you're out of the oxygen. Just like that we got one point in fitness, so we need to do it 20 more times. But instead of just running, you go and boost on the ship. So you need to at least one point in boosting and go to the top of the ship. Then basically you go and jump down. So you will get this falling damage. So after you did it, just go into the ship again, go to your bed and sleep one hour. When you're sleeping, you're regaining your health points and just like that, we leveling up our wellness. So as you can see, pretty easy, straightforward loop. You just go out of the ship, run around a little bit. You will lose your all oxygen very fast. When you're on the red side, just run one circle, go to the top of the ship and fall down. Get damage, go back to the ship and heal yourself. Additionally, if you got companion, this will level up your leadership. You need to sprint when there's nearby active follower. So as you can see, we're using available oxygen. And just like that, we leveled all skills just in like two, three minutes. So that's how you easily rank wellness up to level three, easy, easily rank weight lifting and other stuff. And when using oxygen, make sure to fill out this red stuff. So CO2 should be filled out too. So gymnastics, when you level up to the new level, you need to kill enemies in zero G environment. So basically travel to moons and kill enemies over there. Most importantly, gymnastics will give you this ability when you're sprinting, pressing crouch to slide a little bit, very cool looking, fun option to have. So next up, energy weapon dissipation, basically you will level up it when you're fighting enemies that are using energy weapons, nothing special. Environmental conditioning, so you need to take environmental damage. To level up this again, not going far away from the ship, just find any gas geyser, go on top of it and basically stand like that. Look on the health points, 
and they're starting to reduce pretty rapidly. And you just like that leveling up this environmental damage. Really easy, really fast, just few minutes and it leveled up. So when you take this damage, you lose your max health, you go back to your ship. And cool part, like right now you can level up wellness, again you're healing your damage and rejuvenation so you need to fall below 25 percent health and fully heal three times so just one hour and it's leveled up so as you can see easily leveled up wellness environmental conditioning easy peasy and rejuvenation too so recover from five injuries you're just basically using stuff that will heal you so as you can see our health right now is not in good condition and we use correct item and basically heal ourselves. Fastest way to level up it uh, is to get stuff that will heal you from this broken muscle, broken limbs effect. So to, to get this effect, basically go on top of the ship, jump from the top, you already did it, you got these effects. And same go for decontamination. Martial arts, nearest striker, self-explanatory. In this category, we got left stealth and concealment. And that's once again why we are in this open area you want to go on the planets that got a lot of fauna so for example when you're going on the moon you will see there's no fauna but when you're going on the like green planet there's a lot of animals a lot of creatures and creatures is a lot easier to deal with so as you can see there's some dinosaurs or whatever and even this micros like bugs or I don't know what is it. So what you want to do, you basically want to hide. That's easy to do. And from the hidden position, just kill this beast. So you're doing sneak attack. And just like that, it's easy to level up this stealthy stuff. Same goes for just basically killing your enemies. So basically killing these dudes will increase your ballistics really easy or whatever you're leveling up so maybe you're using melee weapons works too just like that so for sneak attacks to progress concealment stuff you basically need to find enemies sneak up behind them and attack you will have this sneak attack again it's kind of self-explanatory so at the same time you're basically leveling your combat you're killing enemies so that's really easy to do at the same time you can level up your geology and surviving so surviving and geology works like that you basically enter your scanner mode go into any like place over here so you scan it you come in nearby and this basically leveling up your skills like surviving surveillance and when you find any rocks you need to go and gather those rocks so just like that, it's easy to get the skills when you're doing all this stuff. So you can basically level up all the skills on the planets. But there's one cool stuff. So your attacks will ignore 15% of target's armor or even more. But to level up the stuff, you need to kill 20 enemies with non-automatic weapons. What if you're using automatic weapons? You can use, again, this digger that you cutter that you use to gather some rocks. Use it on your enemies, on their, like, these dudes over here. It will kill them. And this will level up this category. So as you can see, that's not automatic weapon, so we get some points in armor penetration, and this will work for all other weapons. Very cool, very, like, nice way to level up, just killing little creatures with your cutter. So medicine is self-explanatory, just use medkits. There's one cool stuff, scanning. So scanning is very fast to do. You need to scan five planets or moons. So basically what you want to do is go onto the map, press on any planet, hold, you just scanned it. So go to another planet and you need to travel over here to being able to scan. So at the same time, just in <laughs> starting combat, with, for example, this little coral box, they are really easy, they are not doing too much damage. You can use your boost box and it will level up your boost box training. So, easiest way, just attack one of the creatures and basically run around using your boost box. It's uh, 
it will be used like boost pack in a combat so leveling up it really easy but make sure to drop on the ground and recover a little bit of the stuff so you need to be in the combat so astro dynamics is very useful stuff you just need to make graph jumps and you will be able to graph jump for more distance very useful stuff to do it easy again you need to do it right away go into this planet mode and go into the system mode and from your system go to nearby system and you press set course and you press jump just like that you power up your gravitic jump do it five times until you level up to level two will take you about a minute or so so basically just tap tap nearby system nearby system set course jump just like that and just like that you can easily level up astro dynamics we rank up making 15 more times working up 15 more times like 30 more times 40 more times or 50 more times and you level up so surviving most science mostly self-explanatory you just need to build outposts create some stuff to create some stuff i recommend to going back to your like to the main uh, first planet go to the lodge just land over here go into the lodge and go to the right go to the bottom and here in the bottom you have all workbenches that you possibly will need so you can you have cooking station you have this industrial workbench spacesuit workbench so you gather some resource go craft improve your weapon and armor stuff so aniotronic fusion destroy five five ships i guess again self-explanatory so tech mostly self-explanatory you just uh, go attack your enemies destroying ships dealing damage with your weapons using boost in the combat so as you can see there is a lot of shortcuts to leveling up many skills especially in physical category in ballistics in combat category when you're on the planet some science on the planet so this is easy when you're using your tech stuff but how to level up your social so persuasion leveled up when you're persuading enemies and other guys mostly you will use it on your missions so mostly in the missions but most useful stuff like commerce can be leveled up very fast very easy and i will show you how to do it just in a second go to neon if you don't know where is neon it's in wall 2 so from the alpha centauri to the right to the bottom wall 2 you go to the wall 2 you find this wall 2 alpha on the alpha planet there is neon city go to neon city and there's a lot of shops where you want to go you want to go to the mining click just to the left from the elevator and let's just check out we need to buy or sell 25 unique items so go and talk with the trader and this store's got a lot of resources so for example he got aldomite and other stuff and you just go and buy one of every of these rocks and basically when you buy these rocks one by one just one rock you don't need to buy every rock you just bought around 20 items just in a second so ne next up you want to sell them and basically just like that you leveled up in about 10 seconds and this will cost you around 1k credits just 1k so then you level up it you need to buy sell 75 items right now again rocks is very nice stuff to buy and sell so just buy all rocks sell all rocks so just in few seconds we almost leveled up this again and you want to continue this stuff going on go to the left of this shop find this weapon shop just talk with your trader so weapons cost really much really pricey stuff what to do go into ammo again buy one ammo of every type you don't need to spend a lot of money on this then just sell all ammo you don't need this again will be unique items so you just sold them same goes for throwables and other stuff go to another trader so good categories will be resource aid and misc so you if you got a lot of misc items like some plates and other stuff that you're stealing sell those from the traders go to the aid there's again a lot of stuff that's pretty cheap you can buy it and then you can sell it 
so you will lose some money but again it's pretty fast way to level up this stuff if you just need to level up this commerce skill so basically in neon city just go into every store buy everything cheap sell it again and you will level up in no time and theft so for theft you want to steal goods how to do it fast i recommend going into again main planet so make sure it's night or just wait sleep until it's night you need to have night time so best place to start a robbery is a commercial district so go to commercial district and it's nice there are a lot less people over here so find some lonely guys like this crawl behind them and start pickpocketing just like that at the day it's really hard at the day it's almost impossible but it's nice there's not a lot of people so you will be always hidden you just steal from the citizens it's very fast and very easy to do and that's how you level up all your skills pretty fast in starfield watch other cool videos on the skin right now and see you in the next videos